Hi, this is Tim from isthisanygood.com and today I thought I'd do a triple unboxing of three recent games I've got. Uh, two of them are for the Nintendo 3DS and one is uh, for the Nintendo Wii. And they're all pretty well anticipated games. Um, we've got of course The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword and that's the most anticipated game on the Wii so far and it uh, looks like it's going to be one of the games of the year basically. And we've also got Super Mario 3D Land. And of course Mario games, very very popular and uh, always well received. And that one's on the Nintendo 3DS. And then we've got Harry Potter, uh, years 5 to 7 on the Nintendo 3DS. So I will be reviewing all these games as well. And quite soon on this channel. And I'll try and do that over the next couple of weeks. So here we go. Okay and we'll start with uh, Super Mario 3D Land. Um, hotly anticipated on the Nintendo 3DS and um, described on the back box as a pick up and play 3D Mario and um, jump and dash your way to the gold pole in all new adventure and um, it's got kind of elements of uh, Super Mario Galaxy New Super Mario Brothers on the Wii and also got kind of elements of Super Mario 64 so it's kind of an interesting combination and it's got the, um, you can see on the back there, you've got the uh, reintroduction of the Tanuki Mario suit. So quick look inside the box and of course we've got our Mario game cartridge in his suit of course. And just interestingly, you've got your um, Mario moves which is just like... Um, I'll just put that down. Just a brief introduction to all his moves. But there's no instruction book. And the reason for that is they've put it into, onto the back. Some more moves, it's double sided. They've put it onto um, the, a, a kind of online version, online version, an electronic version rather. And that will be uh, onto your um, 3DS once the game cartridge is inserted. And it also you get an update, a 3DS update with the Mario as well. And it um, comes with Nintendo points. No instructions as I said. Uh, you just get also, seems to be a promotional leaflet of some upcoming games and some games that are out already. And um, that's pretty much it for Mario. Looks like a great game and you'll probably see some people have already got their walkthroughs completed already. And uh, like I said, it's been out already for a few days in the US. So I'll be doing a review on that one, along with um, a review on Lego Harry Potter, which we'll have a quick look at next. So just looking at the back, the battle is building. Uh, encounter new faces, new challenges and more magic. And there's um, over 150 characters to unlock. And you can explore different sort of scenes and places um, from the films years five to seven. Now this is there's two editions of this, and this one comes as you can see with a mini build Lego set. Not sure how widely available it is. I think it's pretty widely available in both sets, and you can just see you get a mini sort of Harry Potter Lego set, which is quite nice. Makes a nice present if uh, you're into the Lego games. And uh, just have a quick look inside the box. And we've got, of course, the um, game cartridge there. And, of course, the instructions. And for some reason, I didn't get any points with my game. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. And uh, I'm not sure. I'll just have a quick look through the instructions. There is some street pass functionality, but there's no online functionality. And uh, there's lots of building of Lego as per the Lego type games and uh, it looks like a really good game so having another look at that and I'll be doing a review as well on this channel very soon so f finally we're going to come on to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword okay now this is the uh, special edition and I'll be fairly brief with this um, unboxing and it comes with the uh, Wii Motion Plus controller inside and of course you can see the Zelda logo on it and of course it's all in gold 
Also comes with a orchestral CD as well, the 25th anniversary CD. So just having a quick look inside. You've got your rather nice looking uh, controller. Don't really care for the um, plastic sleeve. Of course, that protects it. Didn't do that in gold. I suppose it would have been pretty difficult. Still a very nice looking controller. And it's got, of course, the Wii Motion Plus built in. So having a look inside as well. We have got, of course, if I can fight it out of the box, we've got the game cartridge, the Sega game CD in the box. And I'm just going to shovel away down the box now. And we have got some Nintendo points, some manuals in there as well. We'll put them down. And we have, of course, if I can find it, got the um, 25th anniversary CD in there as well, which you get with a special edition orchestral CD, The Legend of Zelda Symphony 25th anniversary. So you get that with it as well. There's quite a lot in the box. And you get the um, instructions, which in the UK is a kind of multilingual experience, but it gives you all the moves and the basics of the storyline. So there's quite a lot in there. And um, I think in the basic version, you do just get the, um, just get the game CD, which we're just going to quickly have a look at now. So you can see just the... Um, game there and I'm pretty sure that's all you get um, in the basic version but as I haven't got that version I can't 100% confirm that but I'm pretty sure you don't get the um, CD and you certainly don't obviously get the controller so nice little set and like I said I'll do a review on this one as well very soon so this has been Tim at isthisanygood.com thanks for watching